Kaniac here. Hey, uh, the Briando, your problem can easily be fixed if you record while not sending it to the master. So as you can see, my mic is hooked up on channel 10 and I am uh, also recording the output in my uh, screen capture software. But if I click here, so now you couldn't hear me anymore, but you could still see it there. So if we would record now, uh, so let's do that. Let's have the playlist here. So we have it armed. So we make sure it's on audio. If we put in song mode. Uh, so, oh, it's on loop recording. Let's try that again. So now, so it's, oh, now it has disarmed. Oh, I, this is my settings from last time. I have it on auto. There we go. So now you can see that what I'm saying here, the waveform is showing up, uh, but I'm also hearing myself. But if I would click here, you're not going to hear me anymore, and I'm not going to hear myself anymore, but the waveform is still going to So let's listen to what I said. I'm still talking. And I'm saying these things that you cannot hear, but they're still in there. So that's an easy way to fix your problem. But you might want to be able to hear your own voice when you are recording. And then if you have even more than five milliseconds of latency, it becomes really, really almost impossible to sing or to rap or whatever you do. Uh, in fact, if you if you play back somebody's voice with like a hundred millisecond delay, they, they will start to stutter. Uh, uh, I can't really show. Yeah, I can. Can I click here? Yeah, I can't change anything here because then my 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 audio is is gonna go away. But anyway, um, if you're using Osio for all and your laptop is like newer than 2012, um, well, right now uh, my latency is six milliseconds, um, but I can go lower. Uh, but yeah, that can that can that can quite uh, cause some issues. But there are ways to uh, to work to work around that. And of course, you know, if you get an external sound card and you have a lot of CPU power, uh, then it's absolutely possible to fix uh, latency problems when you're recording and be as low as three to even under one millisecond, and then everything just works very smoothly. But that's not something that has specifically to do with FL Studio, like in. Uh, Audacity, you just don't hear yourself, but you know, there, were, there are ways to hear yourself in Audacity while you're recording as well. And then you would have, if you have latency issues in FL Studio, you would have latency issues there as well. There's just no no way around that unless you have the right hardware and a fast enough processor to process everything in a small amount of uh, possible time. But anyway, yeah, so just uh, don't uh, don't send it to the, ma to the master. Uh, there's other ways of doing it as well. Um, if you have a sound card with multiple outs, what you could do is uh, you can, you, like this channel here, you could send that to a different sound card than the master one. Uh, so like if I if I would be recording multiple musicians in FL Studio, um, you know, maybe I want to have, you know, maybe have my drummer on channel two and I want the drummer only to listen to himself. So I'd have like different headphones all connected to a sound card and I'll have all these different channels and then I can select who hears what and if there is like maybe I want the drummer to hear the keyboard player so I mix a little bit of the keyboard playing into his headphones while he's playing. So uh, that's all possible with FL Studio just like in any other uh, DAW. See ya!